Hey, so Anthropic just launched this thing. It's called Cloud Cowork, and it's a new feature for Max users. They call it a research preview that they built in a week and a half, apparently, using Vibe coding. Yes, even big companies do this. It's called Cloud Cowork, and it's a agent that runs on your files. And with one task, multiple agents can do a lot of work. So let's actually look into this and see how this works. I just subscribed to a Max plan just to be able to record this video for you. So hopefully if you like this video, like and subscribe for more. So we're going to hit try co-work here and you can see from the UI, I don't have any tasks. The progress is empty and there's artifacts and context. What it does behind the scenes is it creates a sandbox for code to run on your computer to do some work on your files. So you can create a file, crunch some data and prep for the day. And uh, this is using Opus 4.5. Obviously you can choose Sonnet 4.5 as well. The main thing that you need to know is you need to work on a folder so let's open up a folder let's say this and then allow. so obviously if you are a developer and you know what cloud code is this tool is essentially cloud code wrapped for non-developers it's a simple non-developer tool if you're not a developer and would like some help with your project for example like to clean up my screenshots you can say hey sort my screenshots from the year 2024 and the year 2025 in folders based on months. I don't know why why I would do that. It makes no sense to me, but just to give you an idea of what the, what are some of the stuff it can do. And we're gonna send it off. And it wants access to the documents folder where my screenshots are sorted. And so I'll help you to sort your screenshots into folders. And it runs a command. Here's the basic thing. All of these commands, and it says output is too large, ha <laughs> uh, ha But it's, it's probably gonna make it anyway. Uh, all of these commands are possible with cloud code. However, for non-developers, the, they are not as comfortable being inside the CLI. And so it matters because for many, many people, cloud code unlocked a lot of productivity tools and you needed to know what the CLI is and now you won't have to. So this is a research preview from Anthropic. And now it says, let me create a script that moves files based on notification date. It tried to run this command and apparently failed. And it's gonna look and see why it failed. And it's gonna probably fix it. Here's the progress plan create the folder structure, moving 2024 screenshots, move 2025 screenshots, verify organization and report results. And apparently I can ask questions about the plan. How about 2023? And there's no indication that I asked the question about this part of the plan, but you can see this little comment here. This lets you interrupt the agent with questions that you have. Oh, the agent moved the 2024 files. Let me also handle the 2025. Both 2024 and 2025 are done. Would you like to also organize 2023 screenshots? Let me check how many there are. And here's how it looks. I have folders, 2023, 2024, and they are sorted into month by month screenshots. That's pretty cool. And at the end of this, I can say, okay, create an artifact describing the work you did and the stats of how many screenshots I take per year and per month and do it a beautiful interactive artifact way. So artifacts are these things in cloud that can generate um, multiple web pages or little programs, right? So this cloud co-work can also help you with analyzing the stuff that you did. And we can see the selected folders here. You can probably select multiple folders. I did not know this, this is pretty cool. And updated to-do list, one more, create interactive statistic artifact, that's great. This is not very detailed, but I'm pretty sure the cloud has a lot more details to do with it. So we're going to wait, get stats for all years and months, and then create it. And, all right. And you can see the statistics here. In the year 2023, I only had 34 screenshots. I only got this laptop in December of 2023, even though I take way more. And I'm taking around 2,500 screenshots per year. As you can see, the peak month it was January and April, and I probably should take a look at 2026. Very interesting that I have this JSX here, which is an artifact. When you open this, it will render this interactive uh, interactive bar charts with, with yearly distributions and organization complete. Uh, and you can see the lines and the bars per month. And this is beautiful. All of this is now possible within Cloud Code with a max subscription. And I'm pretty sure that this is going to be a new big product category for Anthropic because non-technical people will be able to do multiple things by running code on their computer. If you like this type of content, my name is Alex Volkov. I lead the Thursday AI podcast every week. We talk about the best things in AI. Subscribe and like for more.